So how do you do a setup when you're ready to shoot, either inside the studio or on location? The best thing you can begin with is let everybody know what are the goals. What is it you want to do? Once they know the goals, they're easier to follow your direction. Let them know who is the audience and what is the message you're trying to give the audience. And that will help them to understand. It's not really going to be helpful to say, just stand here and I'll, I'll shoot the video. Or just act like you're talking. They want to know, well, who am I talking to? Why am I talking? What's the point of this? And that may feel very boring to you. Like, why should I tell you I'm paying you to be here? But actually, it's very helpful to get them motivated. So during the practice time, you can give more direction. So of course, your actors will probably be practicing a little bit. Don't be shy. Just stand right up, even interrupt them and say, no, try this way, try that way, tilt your head this way, tilt your head that way, change your hairstyle or try a different shirt or different uh, pants or a different hair color even if you need them to change their hair color. Be very straightforward and tell them. They'll be happy to do what you want as long as you're clear. So you can do this yourself or you can tell the director if the director is on set. So if you're paying, of course, you're allowed to say whatever you want and get the product you want. Don't be shy about it. Here we have our back to our line. So we had many different ways to shoot the line and we did that all day long. Now, when you're shooting the video, your production company shooting the video, you should take time to look at the takes. That is, even if you're shooting it yourself, but especially if somebody else is shooting for you, you need to take a look and decide what is NG or no good. Don't be shy to say, this shot is NG, we need to do it again, and then tell them exactly what you want again. It's not gonna help to say it's no good, but I don't know what I want. You need to be very clear, what do you want? Tell them and they'll be happy to satisfy you to do what you want, but you have to be clear. You can go ahead and ask for ideas and inputs from your talent. Don't forget the talent often has a lot of experience. So you may ask them if you're unsure, what do you think you should do? Or if you were unhappy in this situation, how would you act? Let me know and I'll agree with you or disagree. Uh, what kind of gesture would you use? What direction would you face if you were afraid? In this scene, you should be afraid. So how do you think that would work? And the talent would be happy to tell you. It's always helpful to have that extra input. You don't have to take it serious, but it's good to have. And here we have our talent giving a great performance of standing in line. Seems like it should be easy. Well, it wasn't very easy that day, actually. It took us quite a while to get a standing in line uh, video working. Let's look at something else that's not makeup, but is very practical. And that's this little box here. And this box looks uh, look, uh, like a little box, right? It has numbers on it, LED numbers. And those numbers are right now 000. This is a counter or a timer. And the reason this is very helpful is it can help your talent when they're recording. Previously, we looked at the teleprompter, the machine where you can read the words and you're looking right at the camera. Well, having this machine, it's hard to see the, because the, it's not very bright here and we have many lights on, but these numbers come out and they count up or they count down. So the one second, two seconds, three seconds, one minute, two minutes. In this way, your talent can see how much time do they have left or how much time have they used. This helps them understand how to control the time. If you don't do that, how are you gonna control the time? So a clock like that makes your talent or helps your talent to have a bit of security and kind of comfort zone. I know I begin here and I know I end here. Very